but look at this. Look at how beautiful. Unfortunately, this is a foreign country, and at times they can try and play you. And that's what happened today. Morning. Today we are here docked in the beautiful port of Cozumel, Mexico. Well, a very good morning to you. If you don't know who I am, my name is Josh. I'll be your host for this amazing day that we're about to have today. And like I said, we are just now docking here in beautiful Cozumel, Mexico. It's just after 10 o'clock, I believe. Yep, 10.07 this morning. I'm all shiny, you see? <laughs> I'm all shiny because I got the sunscreen on. We put it on extra thick today because you know what happened yesterday. The sun like flipped right on. Here's Mr. Peter. Good morning, Mr. Peter. How are you this morning? Great. We're here docked with the German Cruise Line uh, Thompson Cruises. There's their smokestack. I'm sure you've seen it before if you've been in the Caribbean. They're more of a European based, but in the winter uh, they do tend to come over here to the uh, to the Caribbean and have some cruises here. Their cruises are like super, super long though. Like that ship right there I think is probably on like a 21 or a 22 day cruise. Yeah. Yeah, their cruises are super, super long. And they port like out of, some of them port out of Guadalupe, Guadalupe, some of them port out of Barbados, some of them come from Europe and do like transatlantic and then reverse transatlantic. It's really, really crazy. Yeah, those are long, long cruises. Those passengers are gonna be on there for a while if they haven't already been. Well, today, what are we doing? Today, we are heading to the beautiful beach club of Chacanab. I'm sure if you've considered coming to Mexico and looked at any of the beach clubs, you know you have Playa Mia, you have Mr. Sancho's, you have Na Nachicocum. Nachi Yes. Yeah, Nachicocum, I believe that's how you say it. And Chacanab is also there on the top list uh, for those looking for, you know, things to do in Cozumel. So that's where we're heading today. It's all inclusive. So where all of our food is going to be included, all of our drink is going to be included, all of our fun is not going to be included. <laughs> but it's a small upcharge for some of that stuff. We will be able to snorkel and that kind of thing for you guys. So a super fun day there at Chacanab. And uh, yeah, we just cannot wait to get this day started here on board the beautiful MSC Seaside. We're heading up right now. Let's grab some breakfast before we get off the ship. All right, we're good to go. You? Coffee? Yeah. You? No, not Peter. He needs coffee. I love this area of the ship, especially in the morning. It's always so beautiful. Oh yeah, that's their uh, ball court. Look at that. How fun. And then here's going to be their... Uh, pool deck. Wow, yeah, look at it. Spectacular. And here is the beautiful Port of Cosmo cruise ship. It's a carnival ship, I believe. Oh yeah, I know. I see the red. Yeah. So beautiful here in Cozumel today. I cannot wait to see what adventures we're going to get up to. Some, a lot of people aren't even getting off. Look at that pool. I haven't showed this pool yet. Oh, it's beautiful. That's so inviting. It really is. So inviting. Well, scratch that. <laughs> All the, uh, the one upstairs here is just closed, so we have to go down to eight. At least yeah. that one's open, though. Here we are. Much, much better. <laughs> wonder why they closed that one so early. Yeah. Maybe because it's so... Well, I mean, it's not really early. I mean, it is 10 o'clock, but still, you know. The last three or four mornings we've been up before. That's true. We've been up early. For eight, eight thirty. Well, they've already got burgers getting ready. Yeah. How funny. Okay, let's get let's get a little something. So here's yeah. what we got this morning. So I ended up getting. Uh, they actually had ham on the on the buffet this morning. It's the first time I've seen them have ham. So got that. Some sausage, bacon. Got plenty of protein today, as well as an egg. Uh, just some potatoes there. And then this was the breakfast pizza. I think it's got a ham and egg on it. I don't see very much egg, but you know, whatever. And here is our amazing, amazing view. We've got beautiful closet now. Way back there, I don't even think you guys can see it, but there's a carnival ship coming in and then up here. So this is the this is the pier that we normally dock at. Uh, this is the Puerto Maya Pier. And it looks like there's one of the Oasis class ships up there as well as the Celebrity Eclipse. I think I see a Costa smokestack behind the, uh, yeah, I do. You can see it right there. It's 
so there they are up there. All beautiful ships. Hope to make on every single one of them one day. So right there, guys, is the Carnival Triumph. Soon to be Carnival Sunrise. This is the last time that uh, we will be seeing her as the, as the Triumph because in April and May, she's gonna transform into the Carnival Sunrise, so. Well, there she is, one last time sailing. <laughs> Bye, Triumph. See you when you're in the sunrise. See you when you're the sunrise, that's right. All right, let's get off this ship. I'm, I'm ready to go explore some Cozumel. Exit. Okay, thank you. All right. Ooh, look, there. All right, you won't fall. All aboard, 530. Check that out. Wow. Here we are. I like this thing. It is cool. Now oh, here they are with the photos. Yeah, they're missing the past two. <laughs> yeah. Wow, look at that. Man. Talk about an entrance today. Yeah. <laughs> Punta Lagosta Pier is definitely uh, definitely organized, yeah. well established. There's Diamonds International. If Mama Hogan was here, we would have to make a stop in there. Hopefully she wouldn't come out with anything. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this, they've just got, I mean literally anything you want, they've got it. Look at here. <laughs> All right, so we gotta take a taxi to Chakanab. It's $10 a person from the Punta La Gosta Pier. Thank you. Yes. So, just a uh, word of caution. This is something, this is a great time uh, for me to tell you guys that it's always important to double, triple check everything that you do in a foreign port and in a foreign country. So, on the way over, the taxi driver, on our paperwork, we booked through Shore Excursioneer today. Uh, great company as well, just like Shore Excursion Group. Definitely check them out. On there, it lists that the taxi price, which was not included in our fare, would be $10 per taxi, so $5 a person. Not bad at all, right? It's from Puerto Maya, which is where we normally dock, it's uh, 12. And he said from Puerto Lagosta, where we're docked today, it is uh, 10 per person. So we get here, we fact checked him, we asked the taxi man himself, he said no, it's 12 everywhere. Everywhere you go from the ship, from the, any pier, to Chakanab is $12. So, they're calling the taxi driver now and we're gonna get our money back. Like I said, just a great time for me to tell you guys, always fact check, always double check your work, because you never know, unfortunately this is a foreign country, and at times they can try and play you. And that's what happened today, and we're not gonna let that happen. Now granted, it is only $8, but what upsets me more is the fact that I was lied to. As a tourist, I was trying to take advantage of, but I'm smarter than that, and we double checked our work. So now we just gotta wait for the taxi driver to come back, and we're gonna get our money back, get in here and have some fun. All right, so we got all checked in. We got our map, we got our lunch vouchers. Let's take a look here. So the taxi is nothing on Chakanab. I mean, that's not, Yeah. you know, that's just it's our, just a shady Cozumel taxi driver. I mean, there's nothing they can do about that. It's not their fault. It doesn't necessarily reflect on them. So here is, Peter, would you mind holding that open for me? And show everybody here is a whole map of the park. Um, he said we have access to the whole things. I'm guessing even the dolphin area, yeah. yeah they said the dolphin area, the sea lion shows at 12:30 and 2:30. Wow. So you can see the sea lion. We have a ton of stuff to do today. There's lunch. There's snorkeling. Yeah. What was that? Back there? Zip line and adventure park. Oh, there's dolphins back there, I think too. Oh yeah. 
and then he said that there's like Mayan ruins in, in the botanical gardens. Right. Right. Here. right. So, so we have a plenty, lot of, a lot of stuff plenty to explore once yeah. our uh, taxi driver shows back up. Oh my, oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so that we can go in and actually enjoy our beach day here. Omar, the wonderful uh, representative for, uh, for us for today. He's gonna accept the $8 when the driver returns, and we'll pick it up from him later. At least that's how it's supposed to go. Right, yeah, we'll see if that happens. See if that all, all that <laughs> actually plays, but uh, that's what's supposed to happen. So here is beautiful chocolate. Check that out, Peter. My gosh, hello. Wow. That is beautiful. Welcome. Cool. It is very cool. Yeah. I'm guessing that's the zip line or one of them. Yeah. Welcome. Here's the fish spas. Hello. Here's the zip line adventure. So this I believe does cost extra. Wow, it is so beautiful here. Really Look at the palm trees. So hot too. <laughs> I feel like I'm roasting all over again. <laughs> Look at this. Wow, it's like little, it's so cool. We've got all the different, I've never seen so many different kind of plants. I feel like we're in the middle of the Amazon right now or something. <laughs> yeah. The rainforest. They did a nice job of making it. Really though. This is awesome. Here's your Mayan ruin yeah, replica, Peter. <laughs> oh, good one. Huh? Check that out. What'd you say, Peter? What'd you say? Wow. 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 <laughs> Speaking of which, I got my wow shirt on. You can get yours now over on joshokum.com. It is our most popular shirt we have ever made over there. I'm so serious. Literally, it's flying off like hotcakes. You gotta get yours now. Oh, that's good to know. <laughs> the crocodiles are back there, and we were just walking right next to them in the woods. Right? Yeah. Right. Whoa. This is so nice. Oh my gosh! Look at the fish. Wow. This looks like a Disney thing, doesn't it? What do you mean? Like it looks like that lagoon that we saw in uh, Disney Springs. Oh yeah. It's so fake it's wow. So nice. It's beautiful. Absolutely. Beautiful. Oh my goodness. Hello. Hello. I think we're scaring him. Yeah, he's like, get away. Hello. Oh. Hey, little buddy. <laughs> wow. It's an iguana. It is. But look at this. Look at how beautiful. My goodness. Oh. Check it out. It really is. So, so beautiful. Wow. Okay, we've got to find a spot so we can get in there. Yeah. I am dying to get in that water. It looks so refreshing. We've had like five minutes, literally, of relaxation just <laughs> sitting there and taking in the views. Now we're gonna head up and grab a drink. So we have uh, all inclusive today. So we're gonna grab a drink from uh, the Blue Lagoon. That's our restaurant and our bar. So they have several here, which I think really helps spread out the crowds uh, really efficiently. Yeah, there goes the zip line. Um, it helps spread out the crowds really efficiently. And then after we get a drink, we're gonna go to the Sea Lion Show. Yeah. Apparently there's a sea lion show. We figured we better do that before we get uh, get all wet. This you, huh? this you have to pay for. What's the all-inclusive drink? We're all-inclusive here. 
Oh, he said it includes like. Yeah, he said it includes beer, soft drinks, soft beer. Soft drinks and like. With this ticket. This one. Oh, okay, go ahead. This is the food over here. Go ahead. Oh, we, we just want drinks right now. You have, when you get your food, you, you have to drink. Oh, at the same time. At the same time. You don't have to only drink. So, uh, so we can't right. go throughout the day. Yes. Mm. So it's a one time use? Of course. Okay, so this is starting to uh, frustrate me just a little bit. Um, Chocolab, you gotta get everybody on the same page because this worker says one thing and this worker says another thing. So we're heading back up to the front right now to kind of get everything straight because Omar, the guy at the front, told us that everything was in all inclusive. That's what we paid for, right. an all inclusive beach day, right? With food and drink. We just went to try and get a drink and the guy was like, oh no, it's one time use, that's it. And you have and you to get have to your get the, and you have to get your food and the drink at the same time. So you can't get any drink until and go eat. yeah until you're ready to eat. And that's it. Once you get that, that's it's it. Like, no, no. It's like no. we're we're just thirsty. We just want to right. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go speak with Omar. But I do have to say that uh, so far I'd definitely choose Playa Mia if I came back over yeah. Chacanop way yeah. or even Mr. Sancho's. Right. Um, Cause like I said, just nobody's on the same page here. Nobody. Yeah. Omar. Hey. I'm Fred. Has the taxi driver showed up yet? Mm -hmm. Oh, he did? Yes. Wonderful, thank, thank you, you so, so much. much. Okay, one other thing. So we just went and tried to get a drink and they told us we couldn't get a drink. From 12 to 3 o'clock, she is on the lounge. Vale. Okay. So, can we get as much as we want, or is this a one-time thing? No, no, no. It is one time you go to eat for one time. During the lunch is for 12 to 3 lunch time. So you go eat, it's yeah, like yeah, three hours drinking. Right. Three hours. But so whenever you're having lunch, it's when you start drinking, you can have soft drinks, water, beer, whatever you're drinking. So like, what if we just want water before lunch? Like, you no can have water before lunch, yes you can. Okay, okay, the guy just told us Yeah, no. he said he that we like, can't no. get that. Did you already give him a coupon? No. No, we okay, took you it. You have to give him the coupon for food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you know you got to lunch and drink. Right, right. Well, we're like, we tried to, we just like, we just have some water. He's like, no, you have to give me the coupon. Exactly. But just for water. Yeah, because once you're going to have lunch, that's what you're going to have to take it to bed. Okay, yeah, because like we don't want lunch right now, we just want the water or juice or okay, whatever. If you want water, I think you have to pay for it. Unless, okay. when you're going to have lunch, that's what you uh, that's have to take it, then you can have whatever you want to drink. Gotcha. Uh, mm, mm. I guess we'll see. I mean, I'm, I'm really thirsty, but I guess I, I guess I got to wait till lunch, so. Right, okay, <laughs> so that is quite... Uh, mm. <laughs> that is quite frustrating. Right, like water? Come yeah, on. Yeah, like chocolate. How can you not provide water? I can understand the beer right. and stuff. You know, you. I can get the whole thing with the beer, like not having three hours of free beer. Right. That's fine. Right. We, we just want but juice. You or can't water. have water or juice like available. Right. Like until you're having lunch. Like people are thirsty. Well, and I, I mean, I I would hate to be the person that got here at nine o'clock. Right. Like if you got here at nine nine a.m. and you and you couldn't drink anything. Until because Mexico's so crazy about don't bring anything off the ship. Yeah, and you like, know, and the only option is you 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 purchase it by the drink. And and also like imagine if like we used the coupon to get water and then like we didn't realize that we it was like it was only like a one time right. thing. Right, right. We went back to get lunch. And they're like, oh no, you can't get lunch now. Mm. That is just <laughs> um, yeah. That's not. I don't. I don't like that system at all. No. I mean, I remember Playa Mia. We was able to go and get yeah, pretty all much. All day. All day. Yeah. Yeah. As much as we, we were wanted. We back and forth. All right. Day. But drink. So, um, Chacanab is leaving much to be desired so far today. Yeah. I mean, it's a beautiful park. It is. But service-wise, very, very low. Although I do have to say a big thank you to Omar oh, yes. there yes. for uh, getting us the eight dollars back. We did get it back from the taxi yes. driver. I don't know if you guys heard that, but the taxi driver claimed that um, that we didn't wait for our change. And what am I signing? You say me. We're not waiting to change. No, he... Wait, what? He said that we didn't wait for the change. No, I have it on film. He told us that it was... He said you $20? Yeah, I yeah. have it on film. I gave him a 20 $20. Yeah, because he said $10 each. Thank you. You take one taxi for Chankanap, you pay different price, more cheap. 
So how much is it from, from here? It's it, it, it twelve dollar one taxi here uh -huh. for Changana. Downtown Square is other area, it's other for. Ah, uh, so it's more expensive. Yeah. How much is it from the Punta Lagosta? Ten dollar for people. Ten dollar per person. Huh. But I'm almost 99% sure film. I have it on film when he said he said gracias. Ten, well he said not only that but at the port. Right. Because we confirmed with him because he said $10 per person. Right, so why would we wait for change if I gave him a 20 and he said $10 per person? Right. Why would we sit there mm. and wait for, for change? Anyway, here's the Sea Lions show. Let's try and turn a bad situation good. <laughs> Just leaving the uh, sea lion show. It was cute. Yeah. <laughs> it was cute. I've still got a slight sour taste in my mouth now, though, from if I'm being honest. Yeah. It just, uh, I don't know. I've been to Cosmo several times. Several times. God, how many? Four or five or six. And um, so far, it's probably my least favorite, unfortunately. Just, um, and I do hate that. Right. And I don't think that has anything to do with, uh, you know, how we booked the excursion. Uh, the taxi didn't have anything to do with Chakanab, although it was frustrating. That was more of, you know, just a local trying to scam a tourist and it didn't work. Um, but this here falls directly on Chakanab Beach Park. I really do think it does because uh, even, we you know, when we tried to give them that ticket, they, he said, uh, oh, we don't do all-inclusive here. Yeah. Well, that's not how you're selling it. <laughs> You're, you're selling it as all inclusive when really it is all inclusive, but one time. All inclusive, one time. Your lunch is all inclusive, so when you sit down, you get as much as you like. But that's it. You don't get anything before, no drinks before, no water. You don't get any drinks or water or fruit or snack, anything after. So it's all inclusive, one time. And I think they do need to uh, clarify that. Yeah, they need to clarify that because it is quite, uh, it's quite frustrating, you know. So, but we're going to try and, you know, keep a positive face, enjoy the smile, realize that we are on vacation. We are here in beautiful Cosmo, Mexico, and, uh, you know, just try and make the most out of this day. Next time, flippers. As much food as we want. I ain't kidding. Again, no workers on the same page. Not why I don't drink. Mama Hokum has rubbed off onto <laughs> yeah. me a little bit. <laughs> oh, we have, well, kind of sad though.